Hey, I'm Stephen, this is Pete, and this is Chris. We're the co-founders of Incident.io, and today, really excited to announce that we've raised $62 million in our Series B round led by Insight Partners. We go back to four years ago, three guys around a kitchen table, not really a clue what we're doing. Now, company of 80 people, thousands of teams using us to solve quarter of a million incidents in the last year. If you stream a show on Netflix, you buy something on Etsy, behind each of those is an incredible engineering team. For those teams, when something goes wrong, which inevitably it does, and the company they look to to help them solve those problems is now Instant.io. We've taken the initial idea that we had, which was essentially solve the problem of incident response and expanded that into a much bigger platform play as well. And are now solving very much an end-to-end -end problem for, for modern organizations. We think there's going to be a deluge with software over the next coming years. There's going to be a lot more code, a lot more systems. Those systems are going to be more complicated and you're probably not going to know as much about them as you used to. More people than ever are shipping more fantastic things to production than ever and that is great. With that though comes a high degree of responsibility. If you have downtime, often that equals dollars for companies or trust or respect or reputation. What that means is that context has never been lower on what that code is and how it works behind the scenes. And so when it does fail, people are going to turn to tools to help them accelerate their understanding of pace. And that is really what we are trying to do with the, some of the AI work that we're doing here at Incident.io. If you look at anything in the sort of domain of AI, data is the thing that wins. And if I look at the data that we are sitting on with the platform we built with Incident.io, we know more than anyone else about the entire life cycle of an incident. And I don't think anyone else has data to that level of quality in the industry at the moment. What we can do next is help companies to unlock the power of that data for themselves. If I take all of the data on the last 2000 incidents that you've solved, can I turn that into an agentic version of your best engineer in every incident? I think we absolutely can. And to us, this is the holy grail. Like this is how we think we make the next big step in incident management. We're in this position where we've seen so much opportunity in what we can invest in, and now we have the fuel to go and do that. I've always had a huge list of places that I'd love to invest, and what this allows us to do is double down on the stuff that's working and take some big new bets into areas that we've been unable to tackle until now. And with offices in New York, San Francisco, and London, and open roles across basically every discipline in the company, it genuinely hasn't been a better time to join the company and come and help us build.